Welcome to the Hints and Tips video for Time Matters. This video will show you how to activate the spell check feature to ensure professional entry of your data and also improve both internal and external office communications. By default, the spell check feature is disabled in a new install of Time Matters. If you try to do a spell check of a field in Time Matters, you will get a warning letting you know. If you'd like to use the spell check feature, you need to enable that at a user level setup. File, Setup, General, and User Level will take you to the area to turn on the spell check. On the User Level Setup screen, click on the Links button on the left and the Spelling button underneath. Click on Activate the Spell Checker box. Below, you'll have an opportunity to point to your dictionary path. If you use the default Install Settings of Time Matters, Click up the lookup and then click on the C drive, program files, LexisNexis, Time Matters, Links, and then highlight the spelling folder and click OK. You can also specify where you would like to store your user dictionary path. Most users will store this in the same place as the main dictionary. You also have the option to turn on whether you want a screen to pop open if the spell check has been complete if no errors are found. If you do have this box checked, when you do a spell check with no errors, there will be no notification that the spell check was done. On the More Options button, there are other things you can set for your spell check, such as ignoring capitalized words, ignore all cap words, etc. Read through the options and choose the ones you would like to enable for your spell check. Below you'll have three different choices for a dictionary language. And you can also decide how you want the spell check to work. Once your decisions are made, click OK, click OK again, and you now have the spell check enabled in Time Matters. To spell check a field, open the form, right click on the field, and choose spell check. If it finds a misspelled word, it'll offer suggestions, or you can ignore it if it's not misspelled, or you can add it to your personal dictionary if it is a word that you will use on a regular basis that may not be in the existing dictionary. You can also just click in a field, go to Edit, and choose Spell Check, or hit Control K on your keyboard to run a spell check as well. In this case, no errors were found. Again, the spell check is a user level setting. Any user at the firm who would like to have the spell check feature will need to turn it on at the user level setup. For more in-depth training opportunities, please visit the LexisNexis University.